Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to make these fine classic beaded earrings. They're easy and fast to make and I'll show you step by step so I'm sure by the end of this tutorial you're going to be able to make them by yourself. And when I show you how to make these elements, you could use them as a part of a bracelet, of a necklace, like a pendant or whatever you like and also the colorful combinations are endless you could do so many of them and they all look nice and interesting okay so if you like what i'm showing you here it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh beading ideas in this way you will know when i make matching jewelries to the ones that i have already done and you will be able to make beautiful sets for presents or for yourself and you could also like share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action and if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials please share them on my facebook page that i posted below this video i will be so happy to see your creations down there in description you will see a full list of materials links where you could buy supplies from link to my store and link for paypal donations to develop this channel thank you so much for watching now i will start with the list of the materials Okay guys, so what I'm using for this video are two colors of 11 or 10 seed beads and here what I use are ear wires and you could use any type you like. This is monofilament that is 0.006 inches to 0.15 millimeters. This is size 10 beading needle and scissors. And now I'm going to take about half an arm span of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay guys, and now I'm going to pick up 18 beads and I'm going to alternate them. Two blacks, one silver, two blacks, one silver, two blacks, one silver, and I will have 12 black beads in total and six silver beads. Okay guys, now I have 18 beads and my blacks are twice as much as my as my silvers are. Okay, now I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here what I want to do is make a knot. And I'm making my knot by making here a loop going twice through this loop I meet and pull and then I'm going to make one more knot okay and now guys this is what I have in and I will go through my next two black beads okay and now here I'm exiting out of this black bead and I'm going to take just one silver and what I do is that I go through the following two black beads okay exiting out of the black skipping the silver and going through the next two black beads then again one silver skip the next and go through two beads two black beads and again silver skip the next two black beads okay now guys i'm going to continue this until the end of this row Okay, and I have this, my silvers are sticking up and in my next step I will go through this silver and I will step up in my second row and here what I need is a black, a silver and a black 
and I'm going through the following silver then again a black a silver and a black going through the next silver that's sticking out and again and i will continue these three more times Okay, I'm exiting out of this black one here. And what I need to do in this row is take three black beads and as I'm exiting from this black, I will skip the silver and go through the following black. Okay, now this is what I have. Then I'm going through the silver and my goal is to exit out of the next black. Okay. And I'm going to take three black beads, skip the silver and go through the next black one. This is what I have. Then go through the following silver and black. Okay. Take three black beads. And this time, if you can, go through the next black through this black and then through the silver and the following black in this way you save time okay then i need again three blacks skip the silver and go through three beads okay then again Okay, and I finished this row. You see the cute flowers forming. Then what I want to do is go through these three beads that I added last at the top. Okay, this is the bead that's sticking out the most and I'm going through the following bead after that. And I'm taking three silver beads, okay? and going in the same place one bead before this bead that's sticking out the most or otherwise set through these three beads that i added in my previous row okay mm -hmm. three again and go through these three beads at the top of your flower Okay, and now I'm going to continue this until the end of this row. Okay guys, now this is what I have and now as I'm exiting from this bead here, this black bead at the top, at the center that's sticking out the most, I will take three silver beads, silver, and I will go back in circle through this black one. Okay, and now I have this, then I will go through the black one here after that and through the following silver okay like this and i'm going to take three black beads skip this one in the middle here and go like this And in the center here, ok, 
okay and through the following silver okay skip the silver one here okay and exit here now take three silvers go back exit out of the following silver three blacks okay and i will continue this until the end of this row i will do this off camera and meet you here if you forgot how i did it rewind the video see this part and repeat it from here see you in a while okay guys and here i am where i'm just adding my last three beads from this row and what i want to do next is exit out of one of my black beads that are sticking out the most through one of the angle black beads let's say here okay and here i'm going to attach my ear wire okay and in order to do this i'm taking one silver bead then my ear wire then one more silver and this is what i have and now i will go back through this black bead in a circle and you see what i have and now i'm going to reinforce this joint okay and here what i want to do is make a knot and i'm making my knot by making here a loop and going once and then going second time through this loop i've made and i pull and after i pull i go through the following seed bead and just like that i stick my needle in my mat and i cut my thread and now guys my earring is ready okay guys and now my elegant find seed beads earrings are ready so if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh bidding ideas and you could also like share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action and if you make beautiful jewelry following my tutorials please share them on my facebook page that i posted below this video i will be so happy to see your creations down there in description you will see a full list of materials links where you could buy supplies from link to my store and link for paypal donations to develop this channel thank you so much for watching bye bye from me